after a laparoscopic hernia surgery, how long I would need a bed rest? What would be my recovery after the surgery? And when would be I back to my normal day-to-day -day activities? When can I resume my work back after a laparoscopic hernia surgery? After surgery, would I be able to restart my uh, sports activities, rigorous gym exercises or some of the strenuous work that I have been doing? And if yes, after what time of surgery I can resume all these activities? When can I travel? When can I drive a vehicle after a laparoscopic hernia surgery? When can I resume sexual activity after a laparoscopic hernia surgery? If you are having all these questions in your mind before going ahead for a hernia surgery, this video is for you. Watch this video to get answers to all these questions from me. After a laparoscopic hernia surgery, activities like getting out of bed, walking around, going to the washroom, climbing stairs can be resumed from the first day of surgery. Rather, we encourage our patients to start these activities within hours of surgery as we know that it would uh, fasten up and speeden up your recovery, will also improve your pain and discomfort and helps in prevention of certain complications. And all these activities can be done reasonably comfortably and without any fear of causing any problems at the site of your surgery. Once you are back to home on the next day of surgery, you can resume your day-to-day -day household activities of taking care of yourself with minimum discomfort. We do advise to avoid certain activities in the initial few weeks uh, as a part of precaution after this surgery like avoiding lifting too much of weight something which is more than 5 kgs of weight we also advise to avoid any activities which are going to cause strain or pressure in your tummy or at the site of surgery as a part of this we advise to avoid uh, activities which causes frequent bending down or sitting on the floor cross leg for initial one or two weeks How early can you resume your work depends to a certain extent on the type of your work. Those who are involved in office based work or desk work can resume work as early as a couple of days after surgery. Some form of travel that is needed to go back to your work can be safely done as long as it is not longer than uh, a half an hour to one hour of journey and you are yourself not driving the vehicle. Those patients who are involved with little more physical activity like uh, they need to move around or walk a little bit more at their workplace can uh, resume their work a little later say around after a week to 10 days after surgery. And those patients who are involved in very strenuous or physical work at their workplace would probably need some modification in their work to resume work. Meaning, my advice to them would be to resume work after a week to 10 days of surgery and make some modification at their workplace there such that they would do a little less strenuous work in the initial days and with time gradually increase their uh, intensity of work and start doing strenuous work only after two to three months of surgery. Travel within the city or for short distances can be safely done as early as the next day of surgery by any form of transportation like by a car, bus, train, flight or even by an auto rickshaw without any much concern. For longer distance travels, care should be taken that we take a break at every one to one and a half hours of journey, get out of the vehicle, move around and then restart our journey. For flight journeys, precaution needs to be taken to take a lot of fluids, rehydrate ourselves and if possible to do some calf exercises during the journey to prevent the deep venous thrombosis which can happen likely after any form of surgery. 
care also should be taken to avoid too much of jerks and bumps during the travel for the initial uh, period of surgery regarding driving a vehicle we advise not to drive any form of vehicle for the initial 15 days after which you can resume driving a four wheeler if you are feeling comfortable driving a two wheeler should be resumed after a month if you are feeling comfortable and our general advice is to avoid driving for longer distance and driving too much when it is not necessary for the initial one to two months of surgery so although we advise to resume driving after 15 days of surgery we advise that if not too much of necessary it is advisable to restrict the driving period for the initial two months of surgery After a laparoscopic surgery for an uncomplicated inguinal or umbilical hernia, lighter form of exercises like walking, jogging, cycling, swimming can be resumed after one month of surgery. In certain patients, if you are feeling comfortable doing it, these activities can be resumed even after 15 days of surgery. For the initial period of time when you resume these activities, it should be little less aggressive little milder in form with the purpose of getting acquainted to the ch surgical changes that has occurred in your body to allow your body to get adjusted to these changes to allow your body to heal and with the purpose that gradually you can increase and build up these activities so that at the end of two to three months of surgery you can be back to your normal pre-surgery activity levels Rigorous gym exercises or very rigorous sports activities should not be done for the initial 2 to 3 months. You can resume these sports and gym exercises earlier in a little less aggressive manner to prepare yourself to start these activities after 3 months at an aggressive level. The same goes with the strenuous and rigorous work for those patients who have a very uh, strenuous work activity uh, in general. They can resume their work earlier, starting doing a little less aggressive work, getting acquainted for a couple of more weeks and getting back to their aggressive work level at the end of three months. After a laparoscopic hernia surgery, the advice regarding resuming sexual activity is similar to the advice for other strenuous or rigorous exercises. If you are feeling comfortable, sexual activity can be resumed after 15 days of surgery. In the initial days, you should be a little milder in these activities and care should be taken to avoid excessive strain and pressure in your tummy and at the site of your surgery. All this advice is for patients who are having an uncomplicated inguinal, umbilical or incisional hernia. For all those patients who are having very large hernias, very complicated hernias, the advice regarding the timing of resuming the physical activities and the aggressiveness of the physical activities may vary and change. In any case, it is always advisable that you discuss all these things with your surgeon because he is the only person who knows the exact details about your uh, hernia and about what kind of surgery has been done. I hope this video was helpful. In case you are having any further concerns, queries or questions, we would be more than happy to guide and advise you.